Well, we talk about scoring the basketball off the dribble. One key area that we often miss is the triple threat. Most trainers don't talk enough about the triple threat. And as a result, most kids do not access the triple threat enough when they're in a half court set. So in this video, I'm gonna break down how to use the triple threat position to create separation from the defender. Let's begin. The first thing we have to understand when we talk about the triple threat, we have to understand the footwork. And when I talk about the footwork, what I mean is how to access different sets of footwork to create the separation from the defender. Now in this video, we're gonna talk about the inverted step. Here's what I mean. So when we catch the ball in the triple threat position, we're one, two into the catch, feet are pointing at the basket, we're going to shot fake, get into an inverted drop, dropping this right foot, shot fake, and now we're in attack mode. From this position, we can step back in and shoot it, we can attack to our left, or after we shot fake, we can jab to our right and get into our left hand dribble move. So with this move, we're going to get into a pull up. Left, right catch, shot fake, drop. We're gonna go right into the drop, into a pull up. Now with our pull up, we're gonna get into a two dribble, pull up dribble action. The key to make this move effective is that you have to sell the drop. What we don't wanna do is get back where this left, our right leg is, is straight. We don't want it straight, we want it short, because we want to stay balanced, we want our feet underneath our shoulders, our hips. So if we shot fake, we're still in position to step back in and shoot it. And we're still in position to drive it to our left to get into that pull up dribble action. Now watch, full speed. 